In this video, we return back to Panajacho from San Marcos and enjoy the evening. If we're motivating you to travel, subscribe now. So we are back in Pana, Panajacho. Rough boat ride, rough boat ride across from uh, where we, we came back from San Marcos, but he stopped at, I don't know, four or five different places too. So he's skirting the coast, stopping like a bus, like a boat bus. Um, and it was rough. He's banging, bang, bang, bang. We need chiropractors after that boat ride. But yes, we're back at the, the place that we ate at last time we were here for lunch when we came back from San Antonio Polo Polo because the food was good and we've seen one fly so far. There's flies on the other side of town that are intense and in San Marcos, oh my God, you know, not to slight flies that. Flies galore. It is just, <laughs> and, and no one seems to notice except for me. I don't, I mean, I don't, I don't get it. We left, and they said 400, but that was for a private, for a private boat. Money. That there was only one or two uh, community boats to take you over there, public yeah. boats to take you back and forth, and that wasn't true. We yep. had somebody hustle us and bring us down to the dock. Well, we knew, and I knew he was going to get a kickback when we got on the boat. As soon as we got on the boat, well, before we got on the boat, he asked me how about tip, tip for me. You know, I don't make money. Tip for me. It's up there, he said, uh, pay 50, and it's round trip back and forth. Don't do that. You pay after, actually, you get to the destination. Yeah. Just get to the pay. dock. Go to the dock, and then 25, I guess, is stand. We got to get a video picture of this. So we have black bass and oil shrimp. We were here before again. It is good. in Guatemala, you can see three volcanoes, well, the top of a couple of them, they're kind of sloped out, but still, this is a good view to have all three in one shot, it's, we're on our patio, we just watched the sun go down over the right hand side of one of the volcanoes, and then down on the water, I call it Lord of the Flies. A lot of flies. But I learned one time that flies don't like alcohol. And I happen to have absolute vodka. I'm going to rub it all over myself. I'm going to buy a towel for real. I'm going to pour it all over myself. And there's my lady. Anyway, we're just sitting out here chilling. Um, a good day. Great meal at the place. I forget the name of the place. I should remember the name of it. But on the water, when you first pull into town, that main drag, uh, good seafood. We had uh, the black bass and the grilled uh, fish, fried black bass. And a little salad with the guacamole and fresh tomatoes. Oh my God, the tomatoes. One of my subscribers told me that the fruit and the vegetables are so sweet and fresh because they, they go up to the market at four o'clock in the morning and buy it the day after it's been picked. So it is fresh, the tomatoes are sweet, the cucumbers with that lemon on it, oh my God, that was, that's our best meal so far this trip. Okay, so <laughs> I learned this years ago, I guess, when we were in the Philippines because there was a fly issue on one of our trips, that you take vodka and you put it on yourself. So I don't want flies on me tonight, so I'm going to pour them in the bathroom. And I don't know how much to use, but Instead of cologne, I'm using vodka. Okay, we're in a hotel. We're getting ready to head out and try to find live music somewhere. So, but first, let me stop and just, uh, well, I don't know. 
I don't know if I want to give notes on where we're staying, this hotel that we're staying, because I have a couple of grievances, like the Wi-Fi, just numerous things, like the patio railing being like three feet tall, pocket level. But we're, we're going to go for a walk, maybe Wi-Fi, well no, it won't come back on. Anyway, we're heading out. So we're at dinner, we're at an Italian restaurant, El Bistro, but, but we're trying the Caprese first, and then we're going to try, I think we're sharing with spaghetti con bolognese, and then we'll go somewhere else and try to eat. It's a nice place. So dinner was good here at uh, El Bistro. Uh, yeah, El Bistro. It's an Italian restaurant, by the way. A lot of pasta, a lot of spaghetti. We had the Capriccio salad and uh, we split a uh, pasta bolognese. Now we're gonna find some food somewhere else, I guess. Walk around, try to find live music or a disco, baby. Somewhere else, we'll see. Dark and dusty road. We're walking back from the restaurant. On a dark and dawn, dark and dusty road. At least she's wearing red, I'm wearing black, which I normally, I normally get out to people for that because it makes no sense. But anyway, we're just a couple blocks away. Please comment and share if you liked the video. Please subscribe and kick the bell.